Okay, mass time. Very simple. It's a continuation of main activity of the, the scale factors. Uh, try and compare and measure. If it doesn't work, let me know. Anyway, here is the, the big maths. First one, comparing numbers. Decimal places. 3.21 is greater than 3.21. Is that true or false? Simply start from the left and compare. You may want to write them under each other so you can compare easier. So I might go 3.21, 3.214. Three in the units. If you notice I've lined up the decimal places, very important. Three in the units, the same. Two in the tenths, the same. One in the hundredths, the same. And here, we've got nothing, which would be a zero, in the thousandths, and four in the thousandths. So this number is bigger, which makes this false. Step two, multiplication. Now, if you are uh, multiplying these two digit numbers, don't do them in column have a go in the grid. So for example, I might have 32 centimetres multiplied by 14. I'm going to partition both numbers and then multiply them together. Okay, so I've got 30 and 2 and I've got 10 and 4. When you get really quick at this, you won't even need to write the grid. You could just write the four numbers they equal down to. 10 times, th 10 times 30 is one times three is three, two zeros, 300. 30 times four, three times four is 12. Extra zero, 10, 120. Two times 10, we know it's 20. Two times four, eight. Then we add them up. You can either write them in a math column down here, or you can do it mentally. 300, 420 might give them a tick. 440, 448. 448. Okay, easy. So, scale factors, look back at the video yesterday. Any problems, anything like that, drop me an email. Take it easy, class.